Okay. Maybe you're trying to quit porn because you're, you're watching too much porn and you're getting the damaging effects of watching porn. In fact, I, I, I stopped watching porn for a couple of years and then the last year or so, I've been like watching too much and I, I don't like it. it just, it's, I don't feel good about it and I know that you, know, you end up enjoying sex more with the real person when you don't watch internet porn every single day. That's true. So uh, when you're trying to change your behaviors, maybe you're trying to quit smoking, maybe you're trying to stop drinking as much, binge drinking, maybe you're trying to stop watching all this porn, maybe you're trying to stop like snacking at night and going way over your calories, uh, maybe you're, gonna try, you're trying to stop procrastinating, or, or maybe you want to take on a new behavior, maybe you want to meditate every single day, maybe you want to do a cold shower in the morning for the health benefits, Maybe you want to journal every day. Maybe you want to focus and, and, and read a book every day for an hour. Maybe you want to, whatever it is, whatever you're trying to do. Maybe you're trying to work on your business for two hours after your full-time job. Uh, maybe you're trying to go to the, you know, the gym three days a week. Whatever it is. Don't, when you take on these new behaviors, you cut out old behaviors, don't tell yourself you're doing it for a unlimited length of time. Don't tell yourself, okay, you know what? I'm going to quit smoking forever. You're setting yourself up for failure. You're setting yourself up for failure. And there's no wins in that. There's literally no wins. In order to win, you have to go forever without smoking. If you're trying to stick to your diet and it's 2,000 calories, and you say, you know what, I gotta do this diet until I'm 8% body fat, and you gotta lose, maybe you gotta lose 20, 30 pounds. You're setting yourself up for failure because if you try and do 2,000 calories a day every day, eventually you're gonna slip up and you're gonna feel like a, like a failure. So, Part of the mindset or outlook and concept on this isn't necessarily getting to your goal, it's installing behavioral change. And when you're installing behavioral change, you're less focused on the end result of whatever it is, getting to a certain financial level, getting to a certain body fat or muscle mass level, or getting a certain result from, from doing something. You're more focused on installing the behaviors so they're automatic. Success is the result of good behaviors over a long enough time to experience the success. So by focusing on the behavioral change, you're focusing on the success. But when you forget about the behavioral change, you focus right on the success, you end up messing up the, 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 the process. So focus on the process. So the strategy that I would employ, and I'm even going to do this right now because I told you, I, I'm, I'm up front with you. I've been watching too much porn. It's not good. It's been addictive. And I haven't put my foot down and stopped. So I was like, I already, I, I made the realization, okay, I'm going to stop. I'm going to stop watching this porn, but I'm not going to just stop and be like, I'm going to stop watching it forever. It's going to be three days, just three days, three days. The genius thing here is after the three days, you feel awesome. You feel proud. You're like, you know what? I did it. You get all the good, positive reinforcement, dopamine, serotonin in your brain telling you, you did a good job. You're going to want to keep that, 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 that those neurotransmitters going. You're going to want to keep feeling good about yourself. So then the next step is you go a little bit longer. You say, okay, you know what? Now I'm going to go a full week. You go a full week, you feel awesome. Maybe you indulge a little bit if you want to. Maybe you have no desire to indulge. Fine, whatever it is for you. This stuff isn't as much of a science, it's more of an art. Awesome. You've done the week now. Now, you finish the month off. You do another three weeks. By that point, you've installed those behaviors. I think from my research, you know, you, after 21 days of keeping up a habit, it gets pretty much locked in.